how about let's go back to our energies we said that k times l is equal to n pi right that was the condition we had before we said that k uh, was quantized k is equal to n pi over l right and k when we solve for the, sh the differential equation we we, we can we were able to assign k to the square root of 2 times the mass times the energy divided by h bar. So how would we solve for a energy here? Energy will just be equal to multiply k and h bar and then square it and divide by 2m. Okay. So it's just going to be k squared h bar squared over 2m. That's the same formula we had for the free particle, except the difference between now and when we did the, partic the free particle is now k, is that now k is quantized, right? We now have restrictions on k. What are the restrictions on k? k must be equal to n pi over l. It must be an integer multiple of pi over l. So we let's rewrite this. Instead of k, we write n pi over l squared h bar squared over 2m. So as you can see from here, your energy is quantized. It's equal to n squared pi squared h bar squared over 2m L squared. So those are the allowed values of your energy. Your energy cannot just be any value. It has to be um, n squared, pi squared, h bar squared over 2m L squared. But there are restrictions on the values of n. What are the allowed values of n? 1, 2, 3, 4, and so on. If you had chosen negative n values as your n values, that would still give you the same energy. Okay? All right. So uh, let me rewrite this into an expression that is you'll pro most likely find in your book. It is a more popular way of writing this expression is to rewrite this as n squared pi squared. What's h bar? It's h over 2 pi. So that's h over 2 pi squared divided by 2 times the mass times l squared. So that gives you n squared. Uh, what, wait, this is pi squared. Pi squared cancels out, so that's n squared h squared over 2 squared is 4 multiplied by 2. That gives you 8 ml squared in the denominator. So those are the allowed values of your energy for your particle in a box. Okay, so let's examine what the, those energies are. <clears throat> 